I'm Catherine with Dance Studio Pro. In this video, I'll be going over how to post monthly tuition, along with running auto pay to receive immediate payment. DSP is most efficient when tuition is posted monthly to each account. This way, a single month's tuition can be posted, and parents can either make a payment directly to the tuition amount due, or you may also offer a requirement in auto pay. To post monthly tuition to your customer's account, go to More, Tuition and Statements, and Post Tuition to Accounts. Please note that this is not an automatic posting by Dance Studio Pro each month. Our system is designed for you to have full control of your account. Therefore, posting tuition is a manual process done by the admin user. While in your season's active date range, all dancers will show in a list at the bottom of the screen along with their monthly tuition. Take note, if an account has a credit balance, it will not reflect in the total monthly post. The credit would need to be applied directly to the charge after you post tuition. If no students are showing, click Post Future Tuition Amount. Choose a date that's within your season date range so the tuition will calculate correctly. From there, add your transaction details. Include a memo, a transaction code, along with a date, as you'd like to see it chronologically in the Student Transaction Journal history, add class memos, what tuition percentage you'd like to charge, in case you're only charging 50% of tuition one month, choose a due date, any late fee policies, or early payment discounts. Then click Post Tuition. All posted tuition will show as a charge in the transaction journal on each account's page. For any account that is not enrolled in AutoPay, you may take any form of payment. This means taking a cash payment, check, running their credit card in person, or by a parent in the parent portal. To require auto pay, go to Magic, Online Registration, and select Require Auto Pay with Enrollment. To offer auto pay as an option to your customers, go to Auto Pay Settings, turn Auto Pay on, Use a transaction code, convenience fees, agreement text, and whether or not you'd like parents to be able to opt out online. This is all an option as long as you have a payment processor integrated with Dance Studio Pro. To make accommodations for customers not willing to meet the auto pay requirement, you may allow the system to override that setting for a specific account. To process your AutoPay customers, go to More, AutoPay, then select the setting for what amount you'd like to charge. For example, you may charge the entire monthly tuition or the entire balance, which may include other charges such as competition fees, studio apparel, or private lessons, along with any credits that may be existing on the student's account. And lastly, you have the option to charge tuition or balance whichever is less. Next, select the percentage you'd like to charge. An optional phone number for DSP to confirm the auto pay process is complete via text. And the memo you'd like to show on the transaction journal and statements. Only accounts that are enrolled in auto pay will show as an option to run their payment. With this, scroll down to the list 
and pre-check the auto pay charges. Check all, go to next step, agree to the payment processing terms, and process the payment. Do not refresh the screen or move to another window as auto pay cannot be undone. Once you've completed this process, you can see the status of auto pay by clicking the auto pay status monitor at the top of the screen here. Again, just like posting monthly tuition, this is a manual process done by an admin on the date of your choosing. If you'd like to set up a special payment plan for a family to be run automatically on a specific date, you may look into payment plans. This can be set up on an individual basis, but cannot be batch added for a studio. I hope this answers your questions about posting monthly tuition and running auto pay to receive payments. If you have any additional questions or concerns, please reach out to our support team.